In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install apps on your Amazon Fire Stick 4K Max. So the first thing you want to do is scroll on over to the App Store, which will bring you to this page here. Now, what's quite interesting about the Fire Stick is a lot of these buttons bring you to the same place. So here you'll see the app library, featured games, all categories. Let's now go back to the home menu. And there's also this option here, which I believe is called Quick Settings. So here you'll see some apps, as well as if you go to My Apps, this brings you to the area where you can actually manage all of your applications, which is not loading for me right now. But if we go back, go to Get More Apps. Now this is going to bring you to that exact same page we were at before. So from here, you have a couple of different things. You can go to All Categories if you're looking to find something very specific. You can also find Games featured, so all the most popular applications that people use on their Fire Stick, which you can download. Then we have the app library where you can find all installed on this TV and not installed. And at the top here is where you'll also find search. Now, one of the cool things about search, if we press select, of course you can manually type it in, but you can also use this Alexa button by pressing and holding and saying anything you'd want. And it actually works pretty darn good when it comes to, you know, find this app or open this app, right? So let's go to featured and let's sign, find something we haven't downloaded. Um, we're just going to go with Sportsnet, but you can literally pick any application you can think of, right? Netflix, Prime Video, Disney, et cetera, et cetera. So yeah, let's go, no, let's just go with Crave. We're gonna take Crave. Now, all you need to do is press the select button and once this opens up, you'll have this little button pop up that says download, you own it. So all you need to do is simply press the select button. Now this is going to bring it into a download queue. And once it's downloaded, it's going to automatically install for you. And then it's just a matter of opening up the app. Now, depending on how fast your internet is, depending on you know whether you're using a wired or wireless connection, this can be incredibly slow or it can be incredibly quick. Now I'm already shocked as to how long this is actually taking. Um, we'll just leave this and let's try maybe one more and see if that fixes our issue. If not, I'll show you exactly what to do. So we're now processing another one to download this app. But why don't we just press the home menu because there is something I wanna show you which is very cool. So you'll notice all of these applications on the home menu. These are the applications that you know, you're likely going to be using the most. And if you ever want to switch these out, oh, there's Crave right there. Uh, let's go to the um, quick settings here. And we're going to go to, this is where you have all your different games and apps. And if you ever want to customize it, so, you know, if you use um, Disney Plus a lot, for example, try pressing the menu button. And we're going to select move. You can also go to move to front. Let's just go with move though. And we're going to be moving it up to the top here so that it actually shows when we um, go to the home menu. So now you just wanna press select and now it's in your top here, which means it's going to be in your home menu. So if I press this home button, you'll notice it's now on the home menu, making it more easily accessible. And if you ever wanna you know, sort or change any of these, you definitely can. Just go back to quick settings, press select, and from here you can use the menu button to manually move all those apps to the top. So hopefully this video was helpful. Like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.